Hello and welcome to our channel. Now in this video, we will tell you how the cast of 1957's Leave It to Beaver has changed. I'll show you what they looked like back then in 1957 and now in 2022 how they've changed from being on this sitcom. Alright, let's go. Hugh Beaumont in the sitcom he played Ward Cleaver. In 1957, he was 47 years old and it was with great sadness that on May 14, 1982, Beaumont died of a heart attack while visiting his son Hunter. Life expectancy is 73 years old. But mainly because we want you to feel that you can come to me or to your mother at any time with any problem and we'll understand. I'm from the hospital to die and uh, I fooled him. <laughs> uh, it was a long, hard row. Jerry Mathers in the sitcom he played the beaver. In 1957, he was 9 years old and now he's 74 years old. Don't blow up! <laughs> oh dear, was anyone hurt? Yeah, no. My big brother Wally quick put it out. He grabbed a extinguisher. Seemed like it's, well, but it's never been off the air. Right. It's 1957. Wow, it plays in uh, 50 languages all over the world, so it's not only just in this country, so. Tony Dow in the sitcom he played Wally Cleaver. In 1957, he was 12 years old, and it was with great sadness that Dow died on July 27, 2022, at the age of 77. I guess you noticed my hair, huh? Yes. Wait till Wally and Eddie and the guys see it. They'll flip. <laughs> oh, I'm sure they will, Clarence. You know, funk, you know, not, but depression isn't something you can say cheer up about. You know, it's, it's a very powerful thing. Barbara Billingsley in the sitcom she played the role of June Cleaver. She was 42 years old in 1957 and it was with great sadness that Billingsley died of polymyalgia at her home in Santa Monica, California on October 16, 2010 at the age of 94. Your father did very well in school and I got good grades. You had a grandfather that was a professor. Why, he was considered practically a genius. Buddy Ebsen too. And then um, they were very kind, walked me to the car and put me in the car to go home and I was thinking all the way home. Stephen Talbot in the sitcom he played Gilbert Bates, Beaver's classmate and friend. In 1959, he was 10 years old and now he's 73 years old. I'm getting near the record. Maybe I could time you. You know how to work a stopwatch? Well, I guess I could. Don't drop it. Or that I was on Leave it to Beaver, which, you know, she couldn't believe. So she was watching a rerun back then, and it was the episode where you and I were spying. Ken Osman in the sitcom he played Eddie Haskell, Wally's mischievous two-faced best friend. He was 14 years old in 1957, and it was with great sadness that Osman died at his home in Los Angeles on May 18, 2020 at the age of 76 from complications of chronic obstructive pulmonary disease and peripheral artery disease. <laughs> you put a voodoo curse on me? You little dope. What did you do that for? And using very bad tactics on my part, I assumed that he had continued running when in fact he had stopped and waited for me. And so we were toe to toe and... Uh, Frank Bang in the sitcom he played Clarence Rue the Ford, Fred's son Bully and Wally's friend. He was 16 years old in 1958 and sadly passed away on April 13, 2013 at the age of 71. You mean you're such a crummy player they won't let you? What a punch in the nose. No thank you, Clarence. <laughs> <laughs> Look, Cleaver, you're gonna pick me or aren't you? Business. Let me repeat that. The worst offer, in my opinion, in the history of American business. Rusty Stevens in the sitcom he played Larry Mondello, Beaver's apple-eating best friend. In 1957, he was 9 years old and now he's 74 years old. Tobacco, real tobacco. We had a party last night at my house and I emptied all the ashtrays. Tobacco, you would smoke it. You must be chicken. Stanley Fafara in the sitcom he played Whitey Whitney, Beaver's classmate and friend. He was 7 years old in 1957, 
and it was with great sadness that Fafara died on September 20, 2003, his 51st birthday in Portland, Oregon, from complications of hernia surgery. <laughs> yes, Whitey. We don't have any paper. Doesn't the mushroom or anybody else get to say anything? Well, I'm afraid not this time, Whitey. Do all I get... Jerry Whale in the sitcom she played Judy Hensler, Beaver's classmate and arch nemesis. In 1957, she was 9 years old and now she is 74 years old. Went with mother and father to the picnic. Mother and father had fun at the picnic. Sue Randall in the sitcom she played Miss Alice Landers, Beaver's third grade teacher. She was 23 years old in 1958, and it was with great sadness that Randall died of lung cancer on October 26, 1984, at the age of 49 at the Pennsylvania Hospital in Philadelphia. What? <laughs> well, Whitey, if you do that well, it all goes to make the show a real success. Thanks for watching the whole video. If you like this video, please share it. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel to support us in producing the next videos.